Hey guys, welcome to Digit.in and we have with us the brand new iPhone 12 and not just that, we've also got Apple's brand new MagSafe charging cable and of course a case. Now there's quite a few interesting things about both the phone and this MagSafe setup so we're going to go through all of that but first let's just quickly go ahead and unbox the phone to see what it is that you get inside the box. And we'll just throw the paper off to the side. We've got with us here the gorgeous blue color variant of the iPhone 12. Now this is not the 12 Pro, this is the 12. Interestingly, both the 12 Pro and the 12 have the same size of display this year. So that's actually pretty interesting. And this year iPhone unboxings are gonna be short videos because well, besides the phone, the only other thing Apple's bundling in the box is a type C to lightning cable, which actually this is what you need to enable fast charging on your iPhone. And other than that, that's it. There's no charging brick. There's no wired earphones. And in fact, you do have a SIM ejector tool, thankfully. And this time, just a single Apple sticker. It's not even two. Um, so while that's a fairly minimal uh, deal that you have with the iPhone box, if you were to buy yourself this new MagSafe system for your iPhone, do know that you, of course, need this MagSafe charger cable. This is the primary thing that you will need, whether you use the iPhone without a case or with a case, irrespective of that. We'll get to the case bit in a, in a little while. So the charging cable itself is also type C. Uh, it's a USB-C cable on the other end, so you are still going to need a Type-C uh, power brick. And thankfully, Apple, instead of using a proprietary charging standard, is adhering to USB PD, which means you can actually pick up any third-party charger uh, which supports USB PD and have a great charging experience. So we'll just, it's a lot of hefty paperwork, actually, and you have here the brand new MagSafe cable. It's a massive dock right here and the cable is also pretty long. Feels pretty heavy as well actually. Let's just get this out of its packaging. There you go. This is the magnetic base that makes the MagSafe wireless charging happen on the iPhone. Now it is magnetic in nature and the idea is that the magnets over here will align perfectly with that on your iPhone and there is no possibility of, you know, like if you place it this way, there's no, it snaps in one specific spot, which eliminates the problem of having, uh, you know, misaligned your phone on your wireless charging pad. So that is something that's el eliminated by MagSafe. Now, if, if you guys who are watching this video are, uh, you know, old Apple fanboys, if you've been using Apple products for a very long time, you would remember that Apple did have MagSafe for MacBooks. And the idea of MagSafe was that in case you accidentally yanked on the cable, um, it was not gonna drag your laptop with it. So. That same principle, unfortunately, is not applied here. If you accidentally yank this cable, you're gonna yank your iPhone as well. Now, we also have a clear case, which is MagSafe compatible. Now, all cases may not be MagSafe compatible, and that's because, well, actually, I'm just gonna show you in a bit. Pull this out. And that's because of this little circular thing here and this line. Now. This, this little ring over here has additional magnets which uh, sort of complete the connection between the MagSafe charging pad, your iPhone's uh, internal circuitry. So you will need a case that has MagSafe coil, not coils, the MagSafe magnets built into it. So uh, as of now, right now, we've not actually got any third party cases with us where we can check whether MagSafe will work with them or not and whether there are any MagSafe compatible third party cases available or not. So that's something that we still have to figure out. So yeah, in terms of the pricing, all right. So this entire proposition is not cheap. The iPhone 12, this is 256 GB version is 94,900 rupees. So there's this. Then you have the MagSafe case by Apple, 
which is 4,900 rupees. And then you have the MagSafe charging cable slash dock, which is another 4,500 rupees. And in all of this, you still don't get a charging brick. Um, Apple's reasons for that are environmental and the fact that there's just people just tend to have a lot of them lying around. And while you and I may or may not agree with it, what I do feel is that without by not including a brick, Apple's sort of given you the freedom to choose what sort of a charger you want. Um, because now, for example, especially people who are using modern day MacBooks, if it's a MacBook Air or a MacBook Pro, you can just plug in this cable on one of your uh, Type-C ports on the MacBook Pro and MacBook Air and connect the other side to the iPhone. And same thing with the charging cable that's provided in the box. And that will give you a fast, uh, faster than normal charging experience. So you're not really at a loss of, you know, uh, it's not like you're going to lose anything. Yes, not having a pair of free earbuds, uh, you know, the ear pods in the box is definitely a downer. But Apple's been pushing the wireless ecosystem for quite some time. And this is just their way of telling you to go out there and buy a pair of either AirPods or AirPods Pro. Anyway, guys, hopefully you've enjoyed this video. We've got the iPhone 12 with us and we're going to be reviewing it for you and the review is going to be out very soon so make sure to like and subscribe to our channel and of course hit the bell icon so that you don't miss any updates around the iphone 12 from us thank you guys for watching and i'm going to see you in the next one